Hi everyone, Mama P here. So today is the 15th of January. It's Saturday and we are out and about to find some walks and we found this amazing village which is called Hail Village which has this a well-known well-known giant and nearby has a beautiful walking path which I'll show you in few seconds although it's cold today it's I think it's only three degrees but the Sun is out so I don't mind it if it's like that Teddy is in the backpack so let's keep on walking let's see what we, we can find in here His grave is located on the si south side of the church. You have to wrestle much. Let's go find his grave. We will find the grave of the hail giant. Let's see if we can find it. This is the the church. Wow. Oh, let's keep on walking and see if we can find it. We are actually in the cemetery and we will look for the grave of the well-known giant. So this is his grave. Let's read John Middleton, 1578 to 1623. He worked as a, a bodyguard for Sir Gilbert Ireland. This he, gentle giant provides. He was nine foot three feet. Nine three, my God. <laughs> That's a lecture like three foot on top of me. So that's, so that's his story. His, that's probably the right size of that statue. Isn't it? So this is his grave. The how how big is his grave? Because it says here he was um, nine feet three. John Middleton. That's over three meters, like near three meters high. My oh, God. I <laughs> Is it coffee or tea? We don't need a camera stick. Are you sure? No, you don't. Why not? <laughs> there is a for sale house.
Hello. You got to see the deco out your under. Thanks, Papa. So sunny. I can see now like this. Can you see the window? <laughs> Eddie cannot get over how tall was the giant. He was nine feet three, which is really tall. How big is this field? It will be better in the summer if you walk in here. We've got blue skies and that's the lighthouse. Windmills. And this is another field. Where is it? Blackbird singing in the dead of night. Take these broken wings and learn to fly. Oh, yeah. So this is the lighthouse. And I think somebody lives in this house. The Aquaman. <laughs> we are actually in Hailhead. That's it. And that's where we are. And let's see where will it take us. Uh, I didn't see flies. The first lighthouse was a timber structure built about 1800s, 1838. There's an aeroplane. Gondor. 
I wonder what are they planting in here? So busy eating. He said he wants a treat. Ask him what's that bang? What is it then? It's like I was telling him because the farmers plant all the seeds in the fields to go to the top. So yeah. The birds come down and eat all the seeds. So what you do if you plant it's like a firework in the field. Like a to scare the birds. Oh burning views. Every so often you hear that bang. Okay. <laughs> oh dear. So it doesn't work anyway then. It's a little bit muddy here. Yeah. Here comes the bridge. Be careful. Papa, look at me. I'll take a picture. Say cheese. Cheese. There's another airplane. Nakakamis talagang tumira sa probinsya. It looks like... When it's high tide? Yeah. So you can feel in this area the countryside farm feel nakakamis ang ang sariwang hangin because I grew up in a farm my my father used to own a rice field back in the Philippines so we actually lived we actually lived near the Mount Mayon we grew up in the farm so however when my father passed away I was only three years old so we had to move out of the of the area only because every time the volcano will erupt because our house was in the six kilometers you know danger zone so every time the volcano erupt we had to evacuate and we were young so my mom my mother decided to move out of that area so anyway the rice field was gone because you know some family issue by way back then 
so we forgot about that one now so we survived without the help of them na umagaw ng aming <laughs> kabuhayan so you know with help from from my siblings you know na we managed to to finish our education kahit mahirap so that's part of life kaya pag you know there are situation uh, na nakaka remind sa iyo ng you know past mo masarap din balikan Liverpool Airport kaya madaming mga airplanes at saka mga yun commercial plane at saka maraming you know people who are training I think so you know mga small planes because the weather today is not not too bad still a bit chilly but you don't feel it because of the sun so it's nice I don't mind in the winter if it's cold. What I don't like about winter if it's rainy and wet, because it makes it makes you feel more cold. Pagganon. Ang sweet ng dalawa. <laughs> so they are growing crops here. Sorry, but I don't know kung anong crops ito na ginagrow nila but it's a big field madi nga My dog doon. <laughs> Ang saya ng dalawa eh. Ang saya ng dalawa eh. Baba, baakyat. Parusog, patukad. Glorious mud. 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 Glorious mud. 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 Glorious mud. Hello, horse. How many of you? I like the white horse. You'll see there's such good pink bird down here. I think he, her favorite color is pink. <laughs> pink everything. A 
And now we're back to the giant. Mr. John Middleton. So that's our nice walk around Hail Village. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. See you on our next video. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye, Papa E. Bye. Bye bye, little Teddy. See you next time.